What's going guys, Philip here and I am going to show you how to mount and unmount an image or file using daemon tools. So if you have a file that ends with .iso you'll want to use this program. Uh, I think there is a program called Power ISO that you can use as well but uh, I'm more familiar with demo tools so that's what I will use. So to start off just start the program. Personally I find it easier to just clo close this one down and instead go to the bottom right corner here and find the demo tools icon press right click virtual units and here you see dt note e no media mount image and simply locate your file that you want to mount double click and here you see mounting image and there is there it is done and now to demount it, simply right click, virtual units, go to the same virtual unit you use to mount your image, and demount image. I'm also going to show you how to add a virtual unit. It's pretty easy. Right click, virtual units, and add virtual DT unit. This process may take a while, or, or not. And now you can simply go to virtual units and find that there's there are two virtual units here. Uh, this may be required when you have uh, two or more ISO files you need to mount at the same time. For example, uh, some games have CD1 and CD2, which you want to use at the same time. So, anyways, thanks for watching. Hope this helped you out. If you ha have any further questions. Please don't hesitate to um, message me or comment on the video. Uh, until next time, hasta luego!